Good morning, Mallory. Good morning. <laughs> what are you doing over there? We're setting up the heat gun. You look you look legit over here. Look like you're like ready to jump out of an airplane or something. <laughs> For hanging, not jumping. <laughs> bye bye, standard service. <laughs> All right, guys, good luck. Thank you. I do have to run real quick and spend some of that stimmy on a very special piece of equipment. I want it all, but I'm a my friend, how are you today? All right. I want to buy an RF 15 to 35. And you sold me the R5. I gotta have the lens to go with it. There we go. <laughs> All ready to go. See, I'm currently shooting on the uh, ES 16 to 35, but I bent the lens over here. Oh yeah. Um, so, and plus I just want to use that as an excuse to sit, spin, spin, <laughs> get, get one extra millimeter uh, wider, and I don't have to use the uh, the adapter. The adapter as well. Yeah. And just, you know, sharper glass, all those, all the things. All right, this is where my stimulus money went to support a local camera shop. Garland camera has been around forever. Yeah, I feel great. What do you think? How do I look at 15 millimeters? I installed this mailbox yesterday and I met Audra, who is the mail lady for my deliveries here at Onassis. So I'm gonna give her a key so she can just take all my outgoing mail that I have. Let me give you one Audra, okay? That That's is Audra, funny. there you go, girl. All right, I appreciate you. you. Nice, nice meeting you. you. Good luck. Absolutely. You looking tropical today, Dad? How are you? Good. What's up? All right. Looking good. <laughs> You're looking good today. You're looking uh, like you looking like um, belong on a beach. Yeah. Looking like Galveston go out the boat. Must be nice. Yep. That's, That's Paul. You bring lunch for everybody, Paul? That's you Paul. You want to eat that? Eat it. What kind of you lunch is this? Paul. Huh? My friend Paul. Nice to meet you, Costas. We need to get him a Harley to ride. He needs to ride. Yeah. Paul? He was Pope. What? what? Pope. P-O-B-E. Why, why, why haven't you got, why you got him a, a, a Harley? He, he, he's a rider. He wants to ride. Well, where's your... Why did you not help him out yet? I told him to come over there and get one. Okay. Don't wreck. Don't... Hey, hey take it easy, Jason. No, glasses. it's a new refrigerator. Yeah, yeah. First big product with that... Brick vinyl? We yeah, first first paid product. We've done some practice okay. on some other spots. But All right. Yeah, I gotta gotta go big, right? <laughs> got to, got to. I love it. Uh, the, the sun is coming out and the side is coming up and the morale is being boosted. Today was a morale boosting day. It felt so good to see that sign come up and be installed. Uh, we have a big lift in here right now that Jason's working on, cleaning out all the shelving up top. Coming together, it's coming together. Sometimes it takes a little bit for uh, the ball to start rolling, but when it starts, it doesn't stop. So there's a lot of hardware and a lot of moving parts that make a restaurant happen. I think the most powerful tool is this pen right here. Did you know that in order to serve alcohol at a restaurant, you have to have a, a permit? And I am about to write the check for $7,378 to the Texas Alcohol and Beverage Commission. <sighs> That's how much it costs to poison all you guys. Okay, Mallory said the sign is all done. You're seeing it right now. I have not seen it yet. What you see behind me is a sign. So I'm gonna turn around and see what you guys see. Does it look good? What do you guys think? Does it look good? Moment of truth.
Mallory, what the heck? I am blown away by this. Jeez, that looks amazing. It fit perfectly right between those two white uh, borders there. And it's like so well done. You couldn't get a sign that big doing anything else for, for this amount of money. This is this is a really great investment. You're gonna love it. Absolutely. Thank you time. so much. Though today was just a long, brutal day, I can't pass up a Friday night at Opa Greek Taverna. There's there's nothing else like it. ¿Qué pasa, amigo? ¿Cómo está, Ron? Se fue. Ahorita se acaba de ir. Adiós. This guy eats a lot of Greek food over here, I can tell. Look at this. Yeah. That's 100% Greek food right there. <laughs> so you think we should like the mask like this or not? Or down by the chin? So you're still wearing it by your chin, right? Or a... No. This doesn't count at all. It doesn't count at all? <laughs> what is it covering? <laughs> I, I mean, chin I, I, maybe. I don't know. All right, this is a milkshake IPA from Manhattan Project. Okay. I think it's actually called 10 nanoseconds. Wow. It's very science -y It smells term. good. It smells great. It has like citrus hints, maybe some melon, apricot. I'm getting some white bread on there. <laughs> we just read like on a beer articles about like the flavor, the tasting profiles. I said not to mention the white bread. Sorry, I had to. You had to. Pillowy. Pillowy. <laughs> like it's like it light. It is very light. It is very light and refreshing. With still some of that hop. Tons of citrus and like that hoppy notes coming through. That's perfect for summer. Absolutely. Is she doing a good job? Yeah. Talk in the sky. Yeah. Talk in the sky. Talk in the sky. <laughs> and we're talking tequila. <laughs> Some Elsa Is there like something like better to talk about this place? Not really. I love working past the point of exhaustion, which is where I am at right now. Completely, utterly exhausted, but it was a fun day. Mallory, you really, really did a great job on that sign. I'm so I'm so proud of the work you did. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna enjoy my chicken souvlaki platter here with some blistered broccoli and stewed green beans. And I'll see you guys in a new episode very soon. Cheers.